Yo, so I've been going through builds every single day uh, thinking about what's going to help me get top rep. Uh, more importantly as well, I've been trying to find game-breaking builds. I'll be honest though, there really isn't that many crazy like overpowered builds like the two-way slash play that literally contact dunks, high shooting, high ball handling, hall of fame and high defense. You know what I mean? Like there's no build like that. I'll, give, I'll use the offensive threat for example. They've nerfed driving dunk. Even on my playmaker, my 6'5 playmaker that gets contact dunks. In 2K21, that's not going to be, be a thing. So it's been hard to find a build that can do everything well that's overpowered. But this build right here, it is a demi. And I'm going to let you decide, but I get some, I do get some 6'7 demi god feels from the old days. I'm going to show you guys how to make it. Let me know if you think it's a dub or not. Let's get into it. Do you want me to keep making videos? Drop a like. Alright, so of course it is a point guard, uh, hand and number. That's all you. you. You decide that. Pie chart, we're going pure yellow. <laughs> going back to the build that made me the playmaker. Uh, where is it? There we go. Um, so, like I said, they've heavily reduced the driving dunk these builds and that's okay it's still gonna be uh strong uh, at the rim the finishing it's it's not crazy it's gonna it's not gonna get driving contact dunks but trust me on the twos you will not need it it'll be hop stepping isoing it'll be a demon okay it's not gonna be six five either i'm sure you can already tell by the title what it is but uh anyway top physical profile you want to be as fast as possible for this build uh, again, by the way, I've done all the double checking. So this build is like the maxed badged version. It's got all the best cutoffs. I'll show you at the end. Um, it really can do everything. Like, I'm not just saying that. It, it can do literally everything. Would you get more badges? Yes. Um, if you took off finishing and put it all in defense, you could. Um, if you took off all defense and put it in finishing, you could. Depends how you want to use this build. Uh, for me, if I made this build, I would sit on the twos with it, okay? So, that's how I'm building this. That's how I'm designing it. Um, so, we'll start with finishing. <laughs> max your close shot, max your driving layup, and max your driving dunk. Of course, that's where the biggest change comes. That is not, uh, what was it? Close to 80. I think it was 70, 79 last, uh, last year. So, they've taken 10. Taken 10 off that. Anyway, put this to 35. And that's your cutoff. Seven finishing badges. Now shooting, max your mid, max your three, max your free throw, and then put your post fade up until you get to 15. Right there on the line, 55. That's the cutoff, okay? And then playmaking. Now this is going to be controversial. Um, I can already see someone's going to comment it, so I'm going to address it. Why would you need 30 playmaking badges? Well, on this build, the reason why you actually would want 30 playmaking badges is because it's only going to cost you 69 attribute points. If I told someone you can get 30 badges for literally like 2.3 or something attribute points per badge, what would you do? You'd take all of them, right? That's what we're doing. It costs 69 attribute points to get us 30 playmaking badges. We want to max our pass, max our ball handle, and put our post moves to 50 which is only an additional two points because you want you have to have your pass and ball handle maxed anyway so yeah 30 playmaking it's a broken i actually had 30 playmaking on my original playmaker so you guys know the one that i won gods on i won formula on i got one gods twice with it sorry won formula on trust me it, it, it this is this is the wave um anyway perimeter defense uh you want to max lateral quickness max you don't max your steel, sorry, uh, max your defensive rebound and put the rest in steel. That'll catapult you to six badges defensively. And with these stats, you can still guard ball on the twos. And remember, you're tall. That's your biggest, uh, biggest, I guess, uh, attribute, your height. So yeah, it's going to be a clamp. It can literally do everything, as you can see. Can it finish at the rim? 100%. Shooting? Yes, without a doubt. Playmaking? got 95 ball handle before we change things of course but it will be able to speed boost it'll do everything it has 30 playmaking badges that's floor general dimer off rip for your teammates plus every other badge you need to be a dribble god so yeah and then defensively six it's a, it's enough so long as you can defend six is definitely enough 
All right, so moving on, the body shape, that's uh, that's any, that's up to, oh, also I'll show you, I squeeze them to a T, so ready, you move one stat, lose a point, move one stat, lose a point, move one stat, lose a point, move one stat, lose a point. This is like literally on the edge. <laughs> it's perfectly done, it is on the edge. Um, anyway, body shape, whatever you want, solid, that's fine. Go. I like built personally, but you can do you, you do whatever. <laughs> um, height, now, this is where it changes the game, okay? This is where it changes the game. It's not 6'5 anymore, like I had mine last year. It's 6'8, well, the title's gonna be 6'8, but 6'7's the, the best, as you can see. 6'8, can you still speed boost? Yes, you just need play take, um, but if you put it at 6'7, you can speed boost off rip once we change wingspan. You can still shoot, you can still finish, and your defense is amazing. And look at your speed, it's gonna cross 90, and then when you get the additional points and Gatorades and everything else, and work out. It's a demi, it's a 6-7 actual demi. All right, anyway, minimum weight, and then wingspan, minimum. So we end with 80 close shot, 80 uh, layup, almost 70 dunk. Uh, once you get the plus ones, it will be over there. You can shoot off rip, you can shoot great shooting stats, 86 ball handle, you can speed boost, and then defensively, if you know what you're doing, you'll be able to clamp up with this build, okay? Uh, and then last, but not least, <laughs> please don't take the, uh, <laughs> don't do a bash and take shot creator. Take the playmaking uh, takeover, break some ankles, it's free bread, jump on the twos and ISO anyone that comes your way, baby the little guys, and just abuse the locks. This build is going to be, uh, honestly, I see this build being abused on the twos. I uh, expect to see it a lot there. Threes, probably not so much, but twos, free cash, free wins. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to drop a like and comment. I'm probably gonna be streaming on Twitch. The link will be the top link in the description. Please do follow me, please do stop by, and uh, if you use this build in 2K21, you better thank me. Aloki, Aloki didn't even mention. <laughs> Take this, and then uh, yeah, bang comes out as a playmaker, uh, um, which is, you know, my favorite build. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, anyway, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I'll uh, I'll see you next video. I'm daily uploading again, by the way. What the hell? Daily uploads? Who? What?